today we're visiting the Dallas um, Arboretum. The Dallas Arboretum is known to many as a place of fun, family adventure, laughter, arts, plants, and plants, horticulture, and beautiful people named Raylan. <laughs> stop. Seriously, stop. Legends have it that the pumpkins are, um, they're ancient pumpkins. They're years old and they work all cursed by a witch. So, you have to be very careful when you're c coming through the Arboretum Pumpkins exhibit because the witch, the witch will see you and will find you. Wait, sorry, no, I did not know about this curse. I don't, you didn't tell me about a curse. I was telling you that, I'm telling you, this is part of it. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Pumpkin Patch of the, the Dallas, Dallas Arboretum. Arboretum. The Dallas Arboretum was built in 1975. I don't know if that's true. Yes, it is. Right before this bicentennial. What's a bicentennial? I don't know. A follow us to the magical adventure time of pumpkins. Race you. Ow! <laughs> right here is Christopher Columbus. Is that right? A controversial figure today, but a couple years back he was a hero. So turns out this guy's name is actually Christopher Columbus. Shakespeare. Some people say Christopher Columbus and Shakespeare were the same person, and I agree. Uh, that's actually a super, super big wrong. No, but no one says that. But good try. I'm gonna go this way. Seriously, quit. Come on, keep up. Raylan, I can't breathe. I gotta take this off for a minute. It's okay. <gasps> Remember the breathing exercise his mom gave you. Are you gonna be all right? Yeah, I'm good. Let's go. I have some juice. I don't want juice. The pumpkin was first discovered in 1659. How are you? Uh, and it it was discovered. Crap, my band aid. Discovered in, in on an on a remote island on an island vacation in the Bahamas. That's not right. The, no. <laughs> Grab your gourds. Grab your ghouls. Let's go. Come on, Raylan, let's go. Come on, Raylan. This place is totally freaking cool. Inside of that hatch of pumpkins lives a witch. That's right, she's a real witch. She lives here all year round, but especially this time of year, she can come out and do her magic. We probably should not mess with her though, because there's probably all kinds of spells and... She definitely knows spells and she definitely knows how to put a curse on you, but we won't mess with her. We will just go outside of our house and simply say thank you. Thank you for allowing us to, uh, thank you for welcoming us into your home. It's what looks like an apple and a watermelon. That's crazy. Hey then, look at this. You see this? I got, I got this at the Halloween store to scare Curtis. Because <laughs> he's scared of pumpkins coming to life. Is that funny? That's kind of mean. <laughs> it's funny though. Don't tell him, okay? Curtis! What's that? Who are you? I'm the pumpkin man and I've come to take your soul. Seriously, who is that? Hey, I'm the pumpkin man and I've come to take your soul. It's Raylan. It's Raylan. I don't, I don't. Curtis, it's me. It's Thomas. Stop. It's Thomas. No, it's not. <laughs> it's me. Oh my God. It's Thomas. <laughs> 
You seriously scared me so good. I got you so good. You, you didn't me even know so it was me, did what you? Thanks for coming with us on this, this journey through the most beautiful pumpkin patch in the entire world. In the entire world. Guys, you're gonna want to book a trip to Dallas, Texas to see this. Go get get on and go to Dallas Arboretum. No, Dallas Arboretum and Gardens.org, I think. Dallas Arboretum, Arboretum and Gardens.org slash pumpkin. Slash pumpkin slash Thomas and Curtis. So guys go ahead and like like and subscribe our videos. Like and subscribe. If you like pumpkins, you're gonna enjoy this one. Yeah, guys, if you're you're gonna have a gourd of a time. You're gonna have a gourd time. You're gonna have a gourd, a really gourd time. time. You're gonna, gonna have, have a, a really gourd. Gourd.